How's it going everybody? My name is Brandon Cambridge and welcome to my channel. Today we're going to be taking a look at this exquisite, beautiful, stunning piece of wood, also known as the Snow Falcon. Uh, this here is Brendan Small's second signature guitar with Epiphone, uh, his first being the Thunder Horse, which I yet to own, and he's also got a third one now out, which <clears throat> I've uh, done a, a demo and an unboxing video for already, if you want to check that out, uh, and that guitar there is called the Ghost Horse, and it's sitting on my wall right there, but it's out of frame, so you can't see it, but uh, today we're going to be focusing on this beautiful, beautiful thing. Starting down at the headstock, we'll make our way down. Uh, first of all, we got the pike shape headstock. I believe that's what this headstock is shaped. You got the three and a three tuners. Um, um, the tuners in question, I just mentioned, I don't know if you'll be able to see this, maybe not, um, uh, but uh, they are actual Grover tuners. Very, very nice tuners. They, I find they stay in tune. If uh, I got a nice, fresh, brand new pair of strings on set of strings, uh, they uh, stay in tune rather nicely. I'm not too sure what kind of nut this is. I don't believe it might be graphite. It looks like graphite to me. It does not look like plastic to me. But I could be wrong on that because I didn't really look up too many of the actual specs on this thing. Um, and then we got the fretboard here. Uh, one of the coolest things about this guitar, besides its looks, is the fretboard because the fretboard. I think it was one of the first of its own kind. Uh, you see, you see this kind of material nowadays more. I think there's another signature guitar uh, with Epiphone that actually has this kind of fretboard. But the fretboard material is a um, a sort of hard plastic called phenolic, 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 something like that. Uh, but that's how it's so white. It's not wood. Um, uh, I believe it's plastic. It's a sort of plastic, if I'm not wrong. I could be wrong, but, you know. <laughs> um, but then uh, if you look on the fretboard here, there's no inlays at all. Uh, we have 22 jumbo frets, and then we have a very nice cream binding uh, around the neck, not the neck, the, the fretboard as well. And then you also do have the side inlays there. The neck is also, it's a, um, uh, it's a gloss neck. The whole body's gloss. Um, uh, I'm not quite sure what shape this, I feel like it's a, it's, it's not, it's not a thick neck, but it is wide compared to like a Jackson or something like that. But it feels nice. It feels very nice to play leads and, and rhythms on. I, I find it's very comfortable. Um, uh, but it is a mahogany neck. Um, as well as the body is also mahogany. So the body, obviously, visually, you can tell it's a V. And then we got this absolutely gorgeous, I want to call it a snowburst. I believe on the actual Epiphone website, if you look it up, if they still have it in their ar archives or something like that, I think they call it just white with silver burst. Uh, that's what the finish is, but I like to call it snowburst because it looks really cool. And that's... Uh, that's what my mind tells me it is. On the body as well, you got a nice binding there. And then we got the regular old, not string through, but like this kind of thing. Is, is this tunematic? I think this might be a tunematic. Maybe not. I don't know. Just hard tail. It's got a hard tail. Uh, bridge on there. Uh, you got the two pickups here, which they have very nice white um, um, pickup rings and as well as the uncovered white pickups. These here are uh, the Gibson Burst Bucker pickups. Uh, Brandon Small's quite a big fan of those pickups. He's got them in his other signatures as well. Moving on, we got a good old three-way toggle switch. Obviously down is bridge, and then middle is both of them, and then up is the neck. Uh, and then we got one volume, and then we got one tone. Uh, two things about the volume and tone. The volume's got a push-pull, so you can split the coils. So, obviously, I'm not quite sure which coil it is on these two, uh, but uh, you can get that split coil sound. Uh, obviously, for both of the pickups, whenever you pull it out, it'll split that one, and then that, whichever two are split, will be that in parallel, and then that one there will be another split uh, coil. 
And then with the tone knob, you got a really, really cool um, kill switch. It, uh, you press down on it and it, uh, yeah, I mean, I'll just give a little, quick little demonstration of that. So you can get some fun little things out of there. And then obviously on the top, as you can see, uh, you got the top mounted input jack. Um, yeah. And then on the back, there's just one little plate there to get to the electronics. And other than that, you got the strap buttons. Uh, they aren't strap locks, unfortunately. They just come with just regular old silver strap buttons. Um, but yeah, so that there is the Brendan Small Signature Snow Falcon. Uh, it plays super nice, it sounds super nice, and it uh, looks super nice. Signal Chain is the Epiphone Snow Falcon going straight into my Marshall MG15 head, and then we got the two 10 inch uh, cabinets going. At the same time, this is a pile ripoff SM57, um, and then we also got a Shure SV100 going into my soundboard and then going into uh, Studio One. <laughs>
that is going to do it for this demo of the Brennan Small Signature Epiphone Snow Falcon. Say that ten times fast. Wow. <laughs> uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this guitar. If you got yourself one of these things, comment down below and tell me how much you love yours, because I absolutely love mine. Uh, if you're on the hunt for one of these things, I wish you the best of luck in finding one, and so you can cherish it and love it just as much as I do. Um, it's getting weird. Anyways, everybody, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day, uh, and uh, I will see you all in probably a month or two whenever I come out with the next demo video. Goodbye, everybody.